So like some other custom ROMs, C Android is also back with a new update and this one is version 10.6. It's been some time since this version released but I was able to make this video now. By the way with this version which is C Android 10.6 it is not having any major visual UI changes in this update but the thing is it's one of those custom ROMs which is updating almost every month so that is quite good. Like the old custom rooms which we are talking about, we have Pixel Experience, unfortunately that is dead. We have a lot of other custom rooms example which are just not going forward and those are dead from a long time. C Android is actually quite good because one more thing if you compare it with some other custom rooms, I'll tell you in, in a bit in this video. So stay tuned and make sure to watch this video till the end. Moving on to some of the things which are included in this custom room already. Launcher 3 as expectedly. By the way, for most of the devices, CR Droid will come without Google Apps pre-installed. So if you need Google Apps, you have to install a separate Google Apps package. And that is one of the primary reasons why it is also good in the terms of battery because Google Apps are not installed by default. In the battery backup things, this ROM is actually quite good. And also in the terms of smoothness, compared to some other custom ROM, some things are device specific, but this custom ROM is still good. The launcher is launcher 3 as expectedly because it's not having Google Apps pre-installed. It will it will give you the AOSP style launcher. The this kind of recent panel, which is kind of really okay. It depends which kind of things you want to use. And as expectedly, we do not have the circle to search available. So keep this thing in your mind. Moving on to some of the customizations. Like in some other custom rooms where you have some UI changes in the terms of settings some new customizations like lock screen clocks, depth wallpaper, etc. Those things are not present in CR Droid. And yes, that is one of the main highlights of this custom room. Why? Because most of the custom rooms are giving you almost similar things right now. If you notice them, like we have Project Infinity X, we have Rising OS, even we have Evolution X OS. We have a lot of other custom room examples already. Most of the custom rooms have similar kind of features like we have custom lock screen clocks and else but in this case that is not possible it's actually literally simple and clean from a long time which could be a good thing of course for some of the users. Moving on to security and privacy options. Some useful things which you are looking forward to, one of them is app lock and that is present here. You might be able to use it without having any issues. By the way, this app lock is also present in the default launcher, but in case you wanna change that default launcher to anything else, you want to use Nova launcher, you want to use any other launcher like launcher, etc. Then this app locker might be helpful in case you wanna use it because this app lock will work with any launcher anywhere. So that is one of the advantages. Cloned apps feature is also present here, which is quite good because this custom room does not bring you Google apps by default included. Cloned apps feature is there and you will be able to use this thing. In some of the custom rooms like Lineage OS, it is not having the cloned apps features. Even in the previous update of Pixel OS, the cloned apps feature was not there. Although with the new update, cloned apps feature is back, but with the previous updates, those things were not there. Moving on to some of the other things, for example, moving on to the status bar options, we'll see battery section only have these kind of battery styles available. Unlike in other custom rooms like Evolution X OS, Rising OS and some other, you got iOS style battery indicator, MIUI style battery indicator and a lot more. So those are not present too. If you only need some minimal and useful customization and features, CR Droid is actually a very good choice. As you can see, also the similar options are present. I mean, it, it is not having any kind of, it is not actually like some of the features are missing from here. Only the things which are new, advanced and might be a user specific interest of those things are not present in CR Droid. Also, as you can see, some things in the terms of customizations because CR Droid is also one of the most customizable custom rooms. So customizations are there in the terms of header images, as you can see, available there, working fine. Most of the similar things that you were looking forward to are already present here. Of course, it's updated to the latest standard version, latest security pass, so that's good. It also brings you the Android 11 style quick settings panel, which is actually good too. Moving on to some other options, you can customize the rows and columns because if you enable it like Android 11 style, because it's not enabled by default, you have to choose the circle tiles and then you have to adjust the rows and columns and then it will be look like, it will look like Android 11 style quick settings panel. 
else you can see similar line of options available here too lock screen customizations where you get some lock screen clock styles some ios style clocks depth clocks all these things are not present in cr droid at all at least while making this video with this latest version all those options are not there but we have some custom clock fonts which is actually quite good as compared to some other and else we have similar kind of options present here moving on to the user interface the options related to theming basically monet settings yes these are present you can use custom monet theme in case you want to you don't want to use a wallpaper based theming the option is here for you to configure it navigation bar styles font styles everything is present here there might be some changes in the terms of ui like in some other custom rooms you have better ui i personally think cr droid is not having a great ui but in the terms of support which is actually quite good also updates almost regularly that is one of the main highlights of using cr droid and that's based on lineage os so yes anytime you will get lineage os update you might get cr droid update too so that is quite good heads up notifications are there island notification is there so that's good almost every similar thing what you were looking forward to in a custom room is already present here else all the things are here these were things which you were looking forward to sound miscellaneous i mean most of the things are kind of same here game space is also present here some spoofing options not actually like the other custom rooms like in evolution x os we have some spoofing options related to storage encryption or snapchat spoofing as i just mentioned at the starting of the video too that cr droid is having only few of the useful features and customizations like in some other custom rooms nowadays having some extra options those are not present this could be user specific this could be subjective in case you need more customizations better options right now advanced kind of things you can choose rising evolution and project infinity and a lot more extra things like matrix etc but if if you actually need updates regularly and by the way one of the main and major things in cr droid which i forgot to mention is stability in as compared to some other custom rooms i'm not saying regarding stability that other custom rooms are not stable at all but as compared to the stability level cr droid is one step ahead always because of less customization for sure and only useful things available here and there if you need more customizations definitely install the magisk modules and you are good to go these were the things i just wanted to let you know the support for cr droid is available for a lot of devices so don't miss it link is already available in the description if you like this video don't forget to drop a like we'll see you in the next one take care